Tampa Bay Largo Medical Center is now the first hospital in the country to offer a newly FDA approved technology to help doctors detect colon cancer early. This is great news for patients as the recommended age for your first colonoscopy is now 45 instead of 50. ABC Action News reporter McKenna King tells us how this technology is improving screenings. Colonoscopy patients won't even feel a difference. It's still the same scope, but now it's smarter. Usually it's around 20, 25 percent uh, miss rate as far as polyps. And what we as uh, GI physicians we are afraid of, it's something called interval cancer, which means in between the colonoscopy that we have done and the next one, the patient develop colon cancer. But now with this new artificial intelligence called GI Genius, they're missing less polyps. That's because this machine is programmed to detect 31 million different kinds. I've done in my life more than 10,000 colonoscopies, maybe so 8,000 polyps. I cannot compare myself to an artificial intelligence. Here's how it works. And a disclaimer, we're about to show you this machine in action during a colonoscopy. When the system will recognize a polyp, there will be uh, another screen Square, which is green again around the polyps. A recent study found that GI Genius was able to identify precancerous or cancerous tumors at a 13% higher rate than a standard colonoscopy. Which might prevent 14% of interval cancers. Dr. Mizrahi is confident this added intelligence will save lives and he urges people to get their colonoscopies. The American Cancer Society recently lowered the recommended screening age from 50 to 45. And Dr. Mizrahi says colonoscopy prep is now easier than ever. Actually, there are new products that are tubs, okay? It's not even liquid. You just take those tubs and drink a lot of water and amazing, amazing results as far as uh, colon cleaning. In Largo, McKenna King, ABC Action News.